Okay. Hi, my name is Mohammed Razak from the chemistry department of City College. And I've done demonstration showing you the properties of electron using different um, glass tubes. Now I have here a similar tube that has two electrodes, one on each end, and the tube is evacuated, meaning that they have sucked out most of the air, and then they have introduced a small amount of a different gas. In this case, helium gas was introduced into this tube. Now when a high voltage is applied across both ends, electrons are going to flow from one end to the next of this tube. And in doing so, it is going to collide with the molecules of the gases that's been introduced into this tube. And it will cause the gases to glow. Now you will have to discuss why the gases are glowing and why they are produced in different colors. Okay, so let me collect, connect them all together and you'll see a beautiful display. I have six tubes here connected, different tubes, different gases in them, and I'm going to turn the power supply off while we turn the main lights off. Now you can see the different colors produced. The first one is helium, the second is neon, then we have argon, krypton, xeon, and at the end we have hydrogen gas. Now in New York City, People often say that it is colored brightly with neon signs. Now, not all those signs are neon signs. They are normal gas signs, and they are made up by introducing different quantity of normal gases into a tube, and by using different color of glasses. So by using those two combinations, we can produce a lot of different color. As you can see, the second tube is neon, the fourth is helium. So not all the signs you see out there are neon signs. So I hope you enjoyed this display.